Hi, uh, everyone. Welcome back. Uh, we're about to continue the seminar, so um, please, please take a seat. Um, our next presentation is by Dr. Kian Pang Yong, founder and the CEO of iTouch Energy UK, to share with us the smart solar solution. Uh, however, as you can see, Dr. Yong is in Hong Kong uh, due to obvious reasons. Uh, Dr. Yong obtained a PhD in electrical and electronic engineering from Elster University. He started iTouch Energy in 2012 and is the sole in inventor of the core intellectual property that enables the smart solar solutions. Dr. Young currently resides in the UK and he has recorded a session beforehand. Uh, we will conduct a Q&A session uh, with Dr. Young in Skype afterwards uh, at the last session. So we're going to connect it um, via Skype. So uh, yeah, let's, let's uh, listen to his presentation first. Good afternoon, everyone. It is a great honor to be here. I would like to introduce you to iTouch Energy Smart Solar Solution, an innovative invention that will disrupt the renewable energy market and revolutionize the window blind industry. Our world population is currently estimated at 7.5 billion people, and it is set to grow by 26% by the year 2035. This means increase in energy demand, increase in pollution, carbon emission, and definitely increase in fossil fuel price. So, what can we do? We look towards clean energy for solution. We build massive solar farm to generate megawatts of electricity. We started installing solar panels on our rooftop. We even install smart home devices to better monitor on energy generation and consumption. However, not everyone has their own rooftop space. So, what happened to those who live in high-density housing and work in high-rise offices? The potential market is huge. More than half of the world population live in cities and megacities just like Hong Kong. 3.5 billion people live in city with more than 100,000 residents and around 0.7 billion people live in mega city with more than 10 million residents. This number is set to grow to 6.4 billion by the year 2050. At iTouch Energy, we see this as an opportunity. I would like to present to you Solar Amazing the world's first solar blind system. We develop a simple solar blind module that is easy to install and maintenance free. Together with our low power, long range wireless transceiver, capable of communicating up to 10 kilometers and utilizing Amazon Web Service AWS cloud-based reliable data storage and security feature, we provide a highly adaptive renewable energy and a smart building energy management system. Last but not least, I would like to share with you a short video on iTouch Solar Blind. Thank you very much. Our sun, source of all life as we know it, but sometimes it gets in life's way. Its glare means we can't watch TV or see our computer screens, not to mention how it can make things uncomfortably warm. So we block it out with curtains, shutters and blinds. A simple solution to an age-old problem. At iTouch Energy, we thought one step further. What if we could harness the power of the sun at the very same time we're taking cover from it? Our idea is a world first. Solar panels incorporated into stylish vertical blinds. They reduce your electricity bill while keeping you cool. How they work is very simple. Once installed and connected to your electricity supply, the blinds start to generate usable energy almost immediately. It's affordable, easy to install, and maintenance free. The perfect solution for energy aware homeowners living in apartment blocks who don't have their own rooftop to install solar panels. The iTouch Energy solar blinds are smart too connecting to mobile devices via Wi-Fi and the web, allowing you to control the blinds remotely, monitor your energy generation, and integrate with other smart home devices. 
A working prototype has been built and undergone rigorous testing. Tests were performed on different types of solar cells, different window glazing, and window orientations to perfect the design and performance of the microgeneration system. We've come a long way since our first design inspiration. With UK and international patents pending and interest growing from developers, architects, and home. Well, I guess that's his presentation. Uh, well, yeah, we'll talk to him on Skype later. So if you have any questions, yeah, uh, please feel free to hold your questions until later. So, um, yeah. Next, we have uh, Mr. Barry Tan, uh, Senior Property and Facility Manager, Kaixing Management System Services Limited, with, a, with his topic on attention to install solar panel at rooftop. Mr. Tam has over 30 years of experience in property management service field. He led his team to obtain some remarkable environmental protect, protection awards, including the Bank of China Hong Kong Corporate Environmental Leadership Awards in 2018, Hong Kong Awards for Environmental Excellence in 2017, and HSBC Living Business Award Green Achievement 2016. Let's give a warm welcome to Mr. Tam. Okay. Good afternoon. Uh, I, I come from a uh, landmark law for a uh, management service limited. Today I would share my experience in installation of solar panel at rooftop. Uh, this is uh, my PowerPoint's contents. Uh, part one is a uh, consideration of some criteria. And the part two is the uh, application of uh, renewable energy uh, fit in tariff. And the part three is uh, our case study. Uh, for the, in part one, consideration of uh, ownership. As a property management party, there are number of considerations in ownership, land use, and lease control. First of all, we have to identify whether it is commercial or residential building. It will cause another issue whether it is single ownership or multi-ownership. For a single ownership building, the owner has absolute right to install solar panel at common roof. However, for a multi-owner building, it should be installed by owner in corporation. No owner can install a common roof due to undivided share restriction. Besides, land use of this document are other consideration. If land use or lease document has a cost regarding installation of solar panel control, we have to submit application to land department. Position and orientation attention. Generally, solar panel should be installed at a tilting angle between 10 and 22 degrees degree facing south direction. This is the best angle to achieve optimum power output. This can also maximize the effect efficiency of absorb solar radiation in all times and seasons. The roof or open area must be satisfied with the requirements of structural sun area. We have reserved extra area for the installation of inverter and other related equipment for maintenance. The surrounding area should be designed with a minimum blockage by addressing structure, building, and trees. This table, this table is the comparison of the basic requirement in relation to building safety. We have to make sure the PV system satisfying the following major requirement. It's divided into, into two, uh, two types of uh, building. That is the private building. It includes single owner or multi owner. And the other is new territory exam house. That is the village house. For, for private building, the system is applied for class one or class two minor work control system. 
height of the structure must not higher than 1.5 meters. If individual model is more than 200 kilogram, we need use my network class one to apply. If individual model is less than 200 kilogram, apply with my network class three. All of these building work must be carried out by registered professional or contractors. For new territory exam house, the main difference of requirement from private house, first, height of structure can be made 2.5 meters. This is restriction in average loading imposed of the system, 150 kilogram per meter square. Coverage area is half of the rooftop area, and the projection from external wall is a lot more than 715 mm. House owner must appoint authority person for certification and submission. And the, and the other consideration is fire safety. For roof of private building, where is designed as a refuge for? The area uh, should be uh, maintained uh, sufficient and public fire separation should be allowed. And then a dry powder tight fire extinguisher is provided at the solar PV system. And the, other, and the other consideration is electricity safety. In according with the electricity ordinance cap 406, registered electrical contractor should be employed to carry out the related uh, electrical work and the registered electrical worker employed by the REC should follow the technical guideline of the code of practice to carry out the work. The accurate power rating of PV system should be within the approved loading. And, uh, and, uh, and, and other consideration is business registration and tax return. For commercial corporate Corporation participating in uh, FIT scheme in the course of business is required to apply for a business registration and report in the tax return fee payment. And in section 16i of the Inner Revenue Ordinance, private profit, profit test deduction has been allowed for the capital expenditure on renewable energy installations. <coughs> when all the hardware installation is finished, it's time to fill in the online application form and renewable energy fit in tariff. At the same time, please prepare these three requirement document, business register certificate, preliminary layout the diamond of the system, and the preliminary renewable energy system information and single line diagram system. After the document pre 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 uh, preparation, owners can be ready for meter installation of the re uh, renewable energy system. And the meter replacement. Further agreement with the power company, they would perform a series of on site technical assessment and system tests. After the, after the technical assessment, <coughs> replacement of electric meter should be carried out in the same day. During the period of replacement, make sure that all affected e electrical insulation in good state. 
the mid-time replacement takes time around two hours only. And operation and maintenance of PV system. It's essential to perform periodic operation maintenance of PV system. Regu regular functional check for any damage or loading where wires of PV panel, inverter and supporting structure, especially attention in typhoon season. Usual dust and dirt cleaning on solar panel can enhance efficiency in the electrical generation. It's also suggests to offer original contractor to provide yearly maintenance service. This part uh, a case study on grid solar system at Lemmath Loft. Lemmath Loft uh, is a, a commercial uh, building and and have a, a single owner by uh, Sun Hong Ki, the Sun Hong Ki uh, Real Estate Limited. The PV system is located at uh, 22 floor rooftop. There is sufficient open area for such a insulation. It, it is uh, 8.8 kilowatt on grid solar system. There are total 32 pieces of 275 watt solar panel. They are divided into two groups. 16 pieces in one group. We apply for the CLP renewable energy in towers. Since the capi capacity of the renewable energy system is below 10 kilowatt, the fit rate in return belongs to $5 per unit of electricity. The total rate of supporting structure is 120 kilo kilogram, which is lighting later than the requirement for building, building department, uh, 20, uh, 200 kilogram. The maximum height of supporting structure of solar panel is 1.5 meter, which also fulfills the requirement of 1.5 meter. We submit the minor work item 3.15 to building department for certification. There is a series of electric electrical system after the solar panels. The electric uh, the electricity from solar pan solar system is applied in the palm room at rooftop. There are two sets of DC protection boxes. Research arises are individually connect to each model of solar panel to avoid overcurrent case. After the two DC protection box, an inverter is installed to convert from DC voltage to DC voltage. Then the AC dis distribution box is designed to allocate electricity usage. This PV system is supported with online features. Through the, in through the internet connect, inverter and base surface. We can read the PV system overview. Instant PV generate power record of daily, monthly, and yearly power, as well as the information of local weather and reduction of carbon emission. The whole project installation was completed in October 2018. 
In last month, the record PV power was 1,003 kilo uh, kWh. The average annual PV power produced is around 9,300 kWh. It's approximately equal to five, uh, 59 four tons CO2 avoid per annum. And the uh, payback period is about eight years. That this is the uh, case uh, PV system insulation uh, at Landmark Loft, and my present is finished. Thank you.